Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. As with any repair, you should unplug the appliance before beginning. To replace the lid lock on your washer, you should first use tape to secure the lid. Next, remove the top two hinge screws, securing the main top hinges to the rear panel. Remove the screw securing the wiring and tube cover and pull the cover off. Now, remove the screws securing the upper access panel and pull the panel off. Next, disconnect the lid lock wire harness and retaining clip from the control board. Depress the tabs to release the wire retainer. Now pull the main top forward, lift it up, and support it. Pull the lid lock wires through the main top and disconnect the wiring loom from the retaining clips. Remove the mounting screws securing the lid lock to the main top and remove the old part. Install the new lid lock by positioning it on the main top. Then secure it with the mounting screws. Hook the wiring loom under the retaining clips. Insert the wires through the main top and snap the retainer into place. Remove the support. Lower the main top. Align the slots in the top with the bracket tabs on the frame. Then push the top back. Connect the new wire harness to the control board and snap in the retaining clip. Realign the upper access panel and secure it with the screws. Replace the wiring and tube cover and secure the screw. Reinstall the hinge screws. Then remove the tape securing the lid. You're now ready to plug the power cord back in and confirm that the new lid lock functions properly.